Tonight, the Homeland Security Secretary visits a New Mexico detention center holding hundreds of undocumented women and children who came here illegally. Now, he tells Actions of the News when most of those migrants will be deported. KOET's Megan Cruz has the interview. Undocumented immigrants are coming over the U.S. Mexico border in the thousands, and now about 400 of them are in New Mexico staying at this makeshift home here at Flutzy. That's the Federal Law Enforcement Training Center in Artesia near Roswell. But on Friday, our message to those who are coming here illegally this is the directive from the White House. We're bound and determined to observe. Our laws and our values. That's Homeland Security Secretary Jay Johnson. He says those who don't qualify for asylum will be deported starting next week. Senator Martin Heinrich toured Fletzi with the secretary. Heinrich says he supports how this crisis is being handled. It was good to see that um, the facility is is working well, quite. Uh, Clean and humane. He's urging his fellow lawmakers to approve the $3.7 billion President Obama is requesting. For all those agencies that have to deal with this who uh, are doing things well above what they typically do in a given budget year. The Democrat says the next item of business is to pass some much needed legislation. The immigration reform bill that passed the Senate um, would have given. Uh, a lot of additional tools to be able to go after these cartels that traffic people from Central America. Heinrich says it's the only long-term fix to this influx of people. Megan Cruz, KOAT Action 7 News. Heinrich tells us that reform bill is stuck in the House of Representatives.